Hey guys, welcome back to 7th Stand User. Last time, we got ourselves stuck inside of a mansion, trying to get a submarine, being involved in a party where the entire point was to get a bunch of stand users to come together, just so he could have fun, the guy who was running the party. Yeah. And I'll tell you something, I looked up a bit of a, like, guide, not for, like, the full thing, but I figured out, so, if you didn't know, last episode I went inside the cellar room. My day counter is at 19, which is, uh, below a certain requirement for a side quest. That Sade girl, it's part of a side quest that is apparently really hard. That's what they say. I'm gonna try and beat it. I've heard that if you, like, try it, and, like, you can't beat it, you're gonna need to grind off zombies. So, for now, I'm gonna have to, like, do something about it. We're gonna try and do it. It's gonna be... It's gonna be a tough one. Uh, let's see. Let me see. Uh... Let's see. So, something's gonna be happening. That's all I'm gonna be saying. Anyway, I'm gonna pull up this, just to make sure I know. I think I know where I'm going now, because I was a little bit, tiny bit confused, so... Let me see. Uh... Alright. So, no. I do have saves... ...from before. Oh god. The lag is going insane. There's the rock! Dodge! Even when I'm lagging, I can avoid you, rock! What the... So yeah, this is part of, like, the extra thing. So, let's see what's gonna happen. He swung his arms and knocked that zombie down in a single strike! Another stand user? Uh, who, who was that? You guys don't know him, do you? In any case, looks like we're not the only survivors. We should probably chase after him, because we really, we have no choice. <laughs> Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Guess he's not here. Strange. Maybe he went to the bathroom. I guess not. I guess we're just gonna have to avoid it for now. So, kind of just, we need to follow that guy around. Man, I love lag. Rock! Rock, go away, Rock. Go away, go away, Rock. Alright, there's zombies down here. A lot of zombies. This would be a good place to grind on them. Anyway, what's this? Answer this question. The three properties of intelligence are mind, body, and spirit? Is that what the thing had said? Spirit. I bet there's a clue in the library. Well, I forgot the clue, because I read the clue, and, well, I guess I'm, I'm going to need to go back and check and see what the, uh, the code was. So, yeah, these are doorways. Rock! Put you between the rock and you! That's what the guide had told me. <laughs> or what the random things had to say. Anyway, I need to go, I think I need to go back and talk to Sade. Let me see. There we go. A dark-skinned... Muscular man? I don't know what you're talking about. See, so yeah, her dialogue will change, and then you need to go find him again. Anyway, I need to go ahead and see what it said about mind, body, and spirit. Uh, soul. Mind, body, and soul. Okay. <sighs> I just love it when the game lags, and the stone is following you. I'm gonna go ahead and make a save on this separate path we're taking, just in case. I'm gonna try and unlock the submarine anyway, just because, you know, fuck it. Uh... Soul? Mind, body, and soul. No. It's just soul. F2... F... Alright, so, second floor center security open. Alright, we need to claw our way through the rest of this and get back up to floor two. Mushroom zombie. 
What did I just do? I just autoed, I think, by accident. I did not mean to do that. Oh, I guess I, I did Tornado on my own. Well, I guess that is my strongest skill, so... The AI was just like, yeah, just attack him with the thing you got. They do give good amounts of experience, so... If I do need to, like, grind up for the fights... I should at least be okay. Okay, let's go up to floor two. The game won't lag to death. Zombies catch me everywhere. They did say that you could just escape from them 100% of the time. Let's see. Damn it. I can't really get through now, I just need to fight them. Let's see. Hit that one, because they're gonna focus only on the first one for some reason. Yeah, I've just been doing a lot of these episodes, but it's mostly just because I've been having so much fun with it. So much fun with the murder of everybody. I just like being an OC, what can I say? Alright, there should be something about the center. What the? There he is! Okay, before anything happens, I'm gonna hit save, and then I'm gonna heal up. Found the random dude hanging about. Uh... Yeah, you should probably drink up as well. Without it, we, we kind of need Whole Horse's power if we're going to try and, you know, stay alive out here. Stay alive out there, man. Okay. Make sure I save. Okay. Mystery Man wants to fight. Hurrah! Hmm? Close eyes. He's out of control. Okay, so apparently... From what I read, this guy's got, like, a ton of defense. But he's got a really low amount of spirit. So if I can do a ton of spirit damage, it's a good idea. Oh, we wobbled him over. You see, he only takes one damage. Good thing Tornado is, like, the best skill in the game. If we can keep knocking him over, that'd be the best thing to do. Just don't let him... Never, never let up. Never let him have a chance. He can wallop the enemy. Set me fucking flying. Can you guys, like, help me out? I crashed into a wall. <laughs> Galahad froze up in fear. A good thing Whole Horse didn't freeze up in fear. That'd be bad. That'd be bad! Anyway. Hit him with the tornado. Hit him with the good old meme tornado. Meme NATO, they call it. Oh, I kicked his ass. Okay. Apparently he wasn't that hard, I guess. Man. Everybody got a level up. Learned Anesthesia. Interesting. Ah! Okay. He got away. The hell is that guy up to? Alright, so now if you go back and talk to, uh, Sade, she's gonna ha go ahead and have something to say. When Sade has something to say, it's definitely something. Okay. Just watch out for the rock. I would hate to have to do a dance of death with the rock when I'm, like, stuck in a room trying to get out. Yeah, that's gonna be the worst. Okay. Anyway, what you gotta say, Sid? I don't know who that man is, but you... But should you be more worried about escaping the mansion, don't you think? You're right! If only we could use that submarine to get out of here, then he's toast! Interesting. Anyway, what did it say? It said, second floor two. Let me go ahead and check on the guide so that, like, uh, I know what's going on if he shows up again. Uh. Hmm. <sighs> I'm trying to figure out what I'm doing here. I'm trying to see where he could be. Because I'd like to find him. Because I, I think it would be really fun if we just killed him. I think it would be really fun if we just killed him. Uh... Making sure we're good on time. I always gotta check time. Time's always the most important thing when you're part of the backlog. You gotta wait and make sure you don't die. It's not really telling me where he could be. C, A, A, B... Oh, okay. Uh... Anyway, what did it... It said something about that. Go to four. Okay. Uh, so I need to go 
Back to that same room we were in and go up to what's called Charlie's room. Apparently. I mean, I was gonna go into that room anyway, but I just kind of encountered him there and knew it was a good idea to go ahead and talk to Sade. Okay, there's something to do here, apparently. Unless there's something else it meant. Oh, there's a ladder! Uh, go ahead and make a separate save. I don't want to be stuck without anything. Who is that guy? D don't come any closer! Stay away, zombies! Finally found you! Charlie, or should I say Silver Fox? Thought you could entrap me, eh? Uh, are you the stand users I called here? The name's Whole Horse. Nice to meet you. Unfortunately, we're no friends of yours. W wait you got it all wrong. None of this was my doing. It was all a setup. Let me escape the mansion with you. I'll give you however much you want, please. Uh, I don't know what to do with this item. I don't know what to do with this item. <laughs> this item is a person. Uh, there is a little bit saying. In the upstairs room containing the computer allows you to power the submarine. Uh, you can help him, but whole horse will shoot him anyway. Let's see. Uh, well, it's just saying you get certain things if you help him or not. I think he's an asshole, so let's not help him. Or, what is it? <laughs> let, me t let me look at it again. Uh, if you choose not to help him, you'll get minus three, you'll get bad karma. So, I guess we'll help him. Thank you so much! <laughs> Whole horse! Don't be stupid. He's the ringleader of this whole operation. And if we hand him to the police, he's just gonna buy his way out of it and say the same thing again, and the same thing will happen again. He doesn't deserve mercy. With him dealt with, the stand in the mansion should be taken care of. G Damn. You all. You wouldn't leave here alive. Hmm? Rock. So yeah, that doesn't cure the rock problem. <laughs> uh, because from what we read from the uh, library last time, the rock is not his stand. The rock came to him. So, just like how it worked. Yes, don't. Yeah, we finally found you, Charlie. Or should I say, Barley Charlie. Oh boy. Even if you, uh, from what it says, even if you help him, he still gets shot by a whole horse. Meaning that we created a fucking problem anyway, so. Good idea would just be to let him rot. But, eh. Anyway. And then he just says you're not going to get out of here alive. I think it's probably somebody, I don't know, it's probably somebody else's stand. So yeah. So, from what the guide says, uh... The rock will appear, moving at a faster rate. You can actually progress without talking to him, so this event is completely optional. So, yeah, you don't even have to talk to him. Let's see, input the date. The carving I received from the Italian man was destroyed. Huh? Let's see, I bet there's a clue in the library if you're not dumb like me. Shit. Shit. Out of here. Rock! Does the rock just show up forever now? Shit! Get out of here, rock. You're gay. Go away. Whew. It's a zombie. It's not a rock. <laughs> I always knew you were a rock, son. You always felt like one. I really wish you could try and fight the rock, and then just ne never win. I think it would be funny that way. I'm still trying to look for the dude. The random dude. Let's see. Uh, I'll send this at him, even though they're going to probably finish him off. <laughs> what was that? Learned Bazooka Launcher. 
It's not a... It's not a scroll. It's a fucking item. I guess we're just gonna leave him dead. But I will make an extra save in case I need to make sure he's alive. Anyway. Uh, what am I doing here? What is this? It's a small keyboard-like control panel. No, 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 don't do that. <laughs> bad, very bad. Just say okay. Just do this, okay? Well, it doesn't seem to have anything to do with the submarine. Just leave it alone. Still playing the music, so apparently, what that does, what killing Charlie does, is it makes it so that the rock moves faster, like I just said. Uh. Uh. Okay, then. So anyway, what needs to happen now? I don't know. I forgot what the password. It said something about the engraving? Okay. The guy does have it up. I, I would have already seen it because, you know, I already found it. Please, stop lagging. The game's... The game is not all that complicated. Come on. <laughs> don't you, I don't know why it's lagging so bad. I mean, I know it's an old program. Anyway, okay, so, make sure I'm back up in here so I can make sure everything's recording correctly. Five, seven, five, I said. I bet there's a clue. No, I looked at the clue. It's five, two, five, not five, seven, five. Alright. <laughs> you ever mess up a seven for a two? Never could happen to me. Emergency pump, on. Interesting. So, I should turn on that. I'm still on the lookout for that guy. Make sure you don't have a rock seal. Just trying to make sure I know where I'm going. Uh, okay. Let's see. So, I need to go to something else. Uh,. Let me see. So, now I know where I need to go. Just hoping the rock doesn't find me. It almost found me. So apparently here, uh, I'm gonna leave it alone for now. I know what I need to do. So, I'm gonna put a save in here. I need to... Hello, Rock. I didn't know you were going to show up. Randomly. Phasing through walls, I see. Being in walls, I see. Rock's being fucking a bitch. Mm. Going in here. Going up on a Tuesday. Do you have any changed text? All right. Isn't it nice that the rock is now, like, angry? <laughs> the rock is aggressive. <laughs> I mean, it was aggressive beforehand. It's already been aggressive for a while, my friend. There it is. It's chasing after us like a bitch. Why do you gotta be a cunt like that? I'm on the search for a random dude. Seen him around, rock? Seems like you would know. You own this place, right? <laughs> it's like the old man doesn't own this place. The Rock owns this place. That, that's that's my new lore. He o the Rock owns this place. Don't know how. Don't know why. He just does. Let's search for a random dude out there. There's the dead copy of him. Now that bastard decided it was a good idea to switch himself out for a rock. Strange, isn't it? Why'd he keep it here? If he's lived with that rock for so long, why is it not killed him? Hmm. Strange. Nothing else in here. I'm guessing we just need to move on, I guess. I can't seem to find him. I think I've checked everywhere. I've checked even up in Charlie's room. I guess the only other place I haven't checked is down in, like, this place. 
down here. Okay, well, I guess we'll go ahead and turn on the pump then. No point in messing around. Alright, we can get into that submarine now! Uh, sorry if I'm making so many saves, I just, I'd rather be safe than sorry. Huh? It's that guy from before! Rawr! Here he comes! So, he just appears whenever you need to continue the story. Alright, at least I made a save right beforehand. Good thing I did that, because I don't think I can beat him now. Apparently he gets stronger in this form. Damn. Froze up in fear. Pull horse got knocked out. He does take a lot of damage from the gun. So yeah, just gonna take another try, I would say. Wait, he used Tornado? How can you use Tornado? That's not your skill, that's my skill! Alright, let me see. Maybe I could win this if I just throw wine at ourselves? Come on, if I throw wine at everybody, they should be fine. Mystery man. He still has no name. I, I'm too scared to throw wine at everybody. Who would be too scared to throw wine at somebody? Yeah, Galahan, you're not really doing much, are you? If only Whole Horse was still alive, maybe he would enjoy this wine. He got some SP back. Thank God I threw wine at the dead body. Man, I just, I love it when wine heals my enemy. Heals my friends, even when they're dead. Alright. Animalistic Howl. Can somebody get him off the ground? There you go. He wasn't affected? How can you not be affected? <laughs> God damn. He got up. I guess he's just too much of a bitch to get up now. <laughs> If I make fun of Whole Horse enough, maybe he'll just get up again. He's like, what did you just say to me? What environment hell just said that to me? Okay. Good thing he is, like, this tornado move is too good. He can, like, use my moves, which is so strange. Come on, Galahan. <sighs> Come on, guys. We need to stop this mystery man. He glared at the enemy. Okay, finally, Whole Horse is back from the depths of hell. Okay, I sent him flying, so that means that I could probably just throw wine at us. Good job, Whole Horse, throwing rocks at the enemy. Who wants some wine? In the middle of battle, we need to get drunk. I've always found that fighting while drunk, at least from what I Iron Fist Season 2 taught me, is a good idea. It's been a while since I've seen Iron Fist Season 2. It was nowhere near as good as Season 1, and even then, Season 1 was not that great. Yeah, Whole Horse can't do much damage, but, you know, he's helpful. <laughs> he's helpful. Galahan and me are the ones that are doing the most damage. Come on, you fat fuck, just die! I don't even know what's up with your stand. I don't know what its name is, I don't know who you are, but you're just being a dick. He was set flying. Thank God for Tornado. I think even if I I would say that Three Dog Knight is not the coolest one, I say it's the most useful, at least in battle. I well, got level twenty, level twenty one, level twenty, level twenty two. Huh. We we made it somehow, even though like I was not even healed before the fight. So this was a breeze actually. A frozen breeze. <laughs> Not only is he the size of a gorilla, but his stand's got some strength. Well, now all that's left is to get dressed up for a romantic undersea date with that girl in the bunker. Interesting idea, holy. holy. <laughs> I go, holy. Anyway, I'm making a save. Uh, also, since we're weakened, why don't we just, you know, drink ourselves a bit of wine? All good on health. I need more SP, and so does Whole Horse. Okay. Yeah, I think it's just I just want to get drunk real quick before we go hang out with the girl. No specific reason. No specific reason. <laughs> Zombies. 
Half zombie, half zombie, giant zombie. Man, you gotta hate those half giant zombies. <laughs> okay. Uh, I'm gonna. We need to get rid of those half zombies, so the gang will take care of them. I'm gonna go ahead and, you know, kill the other one while we're at it. Just deal. We can deal with this big one all together. Used a poison attack. Oh no, whole horse was poisoned. Whatever am I gonna fucking do? Whole horse still attacks anyway. Man, you would think he would use some more of his cool skills, but he just does regular attacks. Too bad for you, I'm, like, awesome. Too bad for you, I do so much damage, the game just can't even figure it out. See, when he says it sniped the enemy, that means he used a skill. Alright, great medicine was found. I got level 21. Nice. Miss! Sh shoot You came. You weren't supposed to. Because of my power. He... Power? What do you mean, we weren't supposed to? I thought... I thought you said it was to force people to sign. Cuh. I stand. Promise. Can force people to sign. But... More than that... Once they make a deal with me, they must follow through their promise. No matter what. Well, it's more appropriate to say they lose their ability to break it. That cowboy made a promise with me, so... You came. I promised to wait here, so you promised not to leave me for dead. That's how I ended up being coerced into this job in the first place. And, <laughs> even if I got attacked like this, you couldn't escape your promise to save me. Ah, uh, idiot. What, your power's got nothing to do with it. It doesn't matter how dangerous it was, I would have come to save you anyway. The thought of leaving you never even crossed my mind. Hmm. <laughs> in that case, it's my loss for not trusting you. I, if I made you an exit... You could take him with you, and then he'd return to normal. Michael went insane because of me, because I promised to wait here. His wish couldn't come true, to escape with me. So, he was a friend of yours? To get me out of here, he attacked you. It, it's alright. Don't speak to anyone. Don't speak anymore. With your wounds, you can't afford to. Don't. I'm a goner. The zombie's blood is already mixed with mine. Hmm? W what Yes. But this is fine. Now I'll have enough strength to send Michael's enemies to the same place as him. Alright, so now we have to fight her. So yeah, one fight after another. Gotta love it. Whole horse is holding back, but there is... You cannot brainstorm your way out of this, at least as far as I'm concerned. Uh, so... You can status ailment her. Uh, she's not even as strong as Michael. And his stand was actually called Power of Dreams. So, she can't even use her stand. She's literally just partially zombie. So, let me see. Apparently, you can, like, kind of inflict fear on her, I guess. Uh, let me see. The horse is enduring the attacks. Use ointment. Started to cry, teardrops scattered to their feet. Jason glared at the enemy. <laughs> Couldn't do much. Yeah, whatever. Alright, tornado time. Round animalistic howls. Galahad froze up in fear. We don't care. <laughs> Even if it doesn't do a ton of damage, I can still fight with my thing. Alright. Let's see. Uh, just keep trying at it. The, they don't seem to be doing a ton of damage, but I seem to at least be doing a normal amount of damage if a little bit cut in half. There we go. I think it's just mostly random. Sometimes my attack will do a ton of damage. Sometimes it won't do that much damage, but yeah. It seems that this extra, these extra few fights, at least for me, were not all that hard. Mostly just because I think I was already doing pretty damn well beforehand. I need to drink. Somebody give me the fucking soda. But yeah, I I would see how these would be pretty bad if you weren't, like, level 20 and had 3 Dog Knight. Like, I bet other stands that are not well, like, combatively strengthened, you shouldn't be doing this. You should just kind of deal with it. 
no way to save her. We just gotta put her down out of her misery. We just have to put her down. Whole horse just won't attack a woman. I mean, it makes sense for his character. He doesn't really attack women. Just watch her cry as she dies. <laughs> Nothing we can do. There's literally no brainstorming our way out of this, so we just have to hit her a million times. Without whole horse, but then again, she has less health than, uh, than Michael, second Michael did. Close to being dead. You're close! I always forget, it keeps you on the same attack that you just did. Come on. Got her. Knocked out cold. She's dead. Galahad leveled up, and so did everybody did. He learned sharpshooting. Finally, things will be peaceful. Michael. Whole horse. Well, let's get out of here. If we take too long, we might die too. What'd you drop? There's a letter on the ground. Read it? Sure. Dear Michael, if you're reading this, I'm probably no longer in this world. But don't be sad. Just stay calm and listen. What's done is done. I want you to escape this mansion. There are two other people in here. I made them promise to find a way out. Seize that chance and leave. I've been hearing sounds above, so they're already looking for it. If you get out, beware the woman. Vins. Now that I've seen those zombies, she's definitely a traitor. This room has a scent of zombies in it, too. I'm not sure what I'll do if I'm found. If I turn to a zombie, be a good boy and kill me, okay? Try not to look at my face. I love you, Michael. Sade. Yep. She's also supposed to drop something called a Badge of Honor, but she apparently does not 100% of the time drop that, so... Eh. One of those things. Cow <laughs> this really does seem like a cowboy story for, uh... For, uh, Whole Horse. Let's see, anything to cure, uh, poison? Hmm. Oh, removes poison. That's good. There you go, boy. Alright. All that's left is to get the hell out of here, so... Let me see. I just want to make sure that I know nothing else. Uh... Uh... <laughs> this music. So... All we gotta do now is just get to that fucking, uh, get to the submarine. You could just completely avoid that, even after beating Michael. You could just leave her to be dead. But it's probably a nicer ending to at least see that they're both dead and, you know, we'll be with each other in the afterlife. Anyway, get through the zombies and get onto that fucking submarine. Here it is! Open the hatch! Let's hurry and get on! Come on, start the engine. They're coming closer. I'm doing it as fast as I can. I don't really know how to drive a thing. There we go. Now let's make a break for it. The rock can't get in. And so the group ran for their lives, finally arriving at the western coast of Saudi Arabia. Current day, 20. All right, holy. <laughs> well, I suppose to be seeing you. You really helped me out back there. You're disembarking here. Egypt's a long way off. Don't be stupid. If I got cl if I got cl closing in and in on Lord Dio with you guys in tow, I'd be killed. Besides, I couldn't even save one girl. You can't complain about this much hassle. So you're still siding with Dio? Don't tell me you have a flash bug too. Nah, just cash on the line. Plus, I'm not going to flake on somebody I already sworn loyalty to. Money, huh? Where's a vampire who can't go out in the daytime and get that kind of money? I wonder that myself. But I think he's a guy that makes you believe there's nothing you can't accomplish. And it's not just the bounty. I'd have to work with him anyway. Just remembering those eyes sends chills down my spine. So it's follow him or die. Exactly. You'd be attacked by Dio's minions, even if you didn't help the Joe Stars, right? Same thing. So why not just let it slip to Dio's guys that we have we have a submarine? Relax, I'm still looking for a part. Till I find one, I won't go I dare I won't dare to go near the boss. If words get out that I cooperate with the enemy, I'm history. 
I'm not su I'm not suicidal, thanks. Well, see ya. Watch your back. You too. Well, we should hurry to the meeting place. Yeah, you're right. I've finally gotten some info from Jojo about the meeting point and the enemies they've faced. While we were gone, they've already defeated Empress, Wheel of Fortune, Juices, meaning justice, lovers, and the sun. Five other you five other stand users in total. Wow, that many. Seems like their journey was as harsh as ours. Think of it this way. Dio can't have more stand users up his sleeve. I'd like to think so too, but let's not get too cocky. We'll be meeting them at the small deserted island in the Red Sea. Then we'll continue to Egypt. Deserted, deserted island, Red Sea. Got it. We'll don the disguise and wait for Mr. Joestar and the rest. Also, that was my Discord, not yours. If you heard that. Look over at the script a couple. Of, look over the script a couple of times while we're on our, while you're on your way. Script. I see. Mr. Joestar <laughs> likes to pull these kind of pranks. Hmm. Let's buy some supplies for the trip before we depart. Uh, I'm gonna buy some shit. We got a ton of money after all that, so... Probably a good idea to buy... Maybe 20 sodas. 20 sodas. 20 other sodas. I love those sodas. Ripple-infused cola. Uh... I've still got so much wine. I might buy a couple of these. <laughs> Got a lot of shit, I would say. And so, Jason set off to the deserted island, the Red Sea, to reunite with the group. Somehow, he knew how to pilot a submarine. Don't know how he did. Save the game? Why, sure. So now I can kind of just... Sorry about all the saves. I can kind of realign myself at where I am. Even Avdol's there. Mr. Joestar, there doesn't seem to be anyone here. Okay, back to the other voices. Jotaro. That is... <laughs> I'm just throwing my whole horse voice at him. Uh, Jotaro. That is correct. We're, we're just hiding here out. We're hiding out here to evade detection for a while while I pay a visit to a certain someone. A certain someone? Who do you mean? Huh? A sultan's opinion? A, a sultan's onion? Hey, Gramps. Someone's watching us from behind that palm tree. Huh? Oh, they're getting away! Ah, uh, it's... it's hard to tell from behind, but I think I've seen that person before. I found him! Over there! Hmm. Who are you? That silhouette. Could it be? Wait, I'll do the talking. You guys wait here. My name's Joseph Joestar. I'm headed for Egypt. These are my four traveling companions. I got- I already got your call. Is he... really gone? He never called home after leaving. So everyone... prepared for the worst. Do you have an explanation for this, Mr. Joestar? Ah. Uh, Jason! Jason. Is that really... He's- it's his older brother. When I called the family a little while ago to reassure them, he requested to meet with us. I refused over and over, since he'd been in danger that way. My mouth slipped, and I ended up revealing he was killed by a stand user. So to stay out of the enemy's sight, I had him meet us here. His brother, huh? But, explaining the circumstances of Jason's death won't be easy. You had no part in his death, Bonareff. No. I'm partially responsible. I've already accepted that fact. Is he a stand user as well? Yes. He's been targeted by Dio's assassins as well. Which is why he saw through my story. Is he planning on coming with us? Yes, he said as much. But I don't feel like the idea of dangering a yet another innocent life. Hmm. Mr. Joestar, I'd like to have a discussion about how to proceed from here. Oh, got it. It's getting dark out, so let's talk inside. Anyway, we need to end here because we're about to, we're already over time. So, next time on Seventh Stand User, we're gonna go ahead and see my older brother, which I don't have. 
I'll see you guys next time.